Welcome to the lesson how to do a Kono. Thanks Ben, you share with me this video. You want to know how to make your Kono better? Actually, you are not that far. Ben wrote me, he feels like he don't have enough power to lift the board and to go for the full rotation. Now we will go through this video by slow motion and show the points where you should work on your mistakes. Because you are a bit downwind, you need to make a longer curve to go upwind, to come back to the point where you want to be in the beginning of the move. Now as you can see, your body weight is a bit too much backward, towards the tail of your board, and then it's make a break to your speed. And in this point, you automatically go a bit upwind to try to fix your position. And then when you pull the back of your boom, you kind of try to take it backwards to bring it back to you because you are kind of far on your tail. And from now on, you do the curve of the upwind a bit too long, and in this point, you lose a lot of speed. You want to throw the sail as quick as possible to not lose this. In this point, even though that you are a bit too low, you have two things to do. The first one is to close the backhand to get into the rotation. Second, to point your feet forward to prepare yourself to the landing. And I guess if you follow those points, you will feel already a big progress. Now I will show you myself how I do the Kono, and same points how I do them. When I start the Kono, I try to keep the body weight on the center of the board. I kind of let go the tail of the boom down and not pulling it backwards. In this position that I'm almost not going downwind, I throw the sail, push my back leg, throw the maneuver without carving upwind. By that I keep the energy in the sail and I can jump it high. In this part, I start to point my feet forward, I will close my back hand to keep the rotation. In here, there is a different angle of the move. So at the bottom line, it's all about to keep the energy and the speed. We focused on the beginning of the move because this is the important part that you struggle with. And with a little bit more training, you will make it good. Hope you like my tips. Please subscribe to my channel. And if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below. If you want me to guide you in another trick, feel free to send me a message. Ciao and enjoy the water.